All right. Hey, so now we've got something that will make you think about helping others. It really will. It's an organization called Be for Life, and they are working to stop extreme poverty in Africa, Uganda to be specific, by creating a source of income for people in that area. Now, Be for Life is giving these Ugandan women an opportunity to earn a living. And here we go. Imagine that you can't afford anything beyond cornmeal. Nothing. If you need an aspirin, too bad. You don't have any money. If your child needs to go to the doctor, too bad. It just does not happen. All of your attention goes to eating. Well, by handcrafting beads from recycled paper and turning them into necklaces, bracelets, and earrings, what was once trash becomes beautiful jewelry, translating into money, food, and best of all, hope. With the finished jewelry products, others can support these women by purchasing their products. And joining me here in studio with more on this liberating and inspiring project are Leah Colby with Be For Life and Cliff Miller. He's been on the show before from MJ Christensen Jewelers. Thank you so much for joining us and thank you for bringing us that story. What a story. Yes, yeah. it's amazing. Yeah, Leah, how, tell us first, how did you guys run across this group of people? Because surely there's poverty all over the world. Why did you focus on this one? Uh, one of the founders of Bead for Life, her husband is an HIV AIDS doctor. Mm. And so three women from Boulder, Colorado were in Uganda and saw a woman sitting in front of her mud hut rolling these beads out of recycled paper. A mud hut. Yes. Wow. And yeah. um, she went back into her house, came out, and had an arm full of beads, and they brought the beads back to the U.S. Mm -hmm. People loved them, and it kind of grew from there. And most of these women were living on less than a dollar a day Ooh. before they started working for Bead for Life. Yeah. And now they have housing, health care, um, education, yeah. clothing. Just a little bit yes. went a long way, yes. right? Somebody recognizing somebody yeah. else. Now, we have the jewelry here. And Cliff, I'm going to show yours in just a second. But, Leah, tell us what we have here and the necklace that I'm wearing as well. So we have, these are some bangle bracelets. Um, the jewelry ranges from 5 to $30. Look at this, guys. I want to show you so, all of these bracelets. From yeah. 5 to $30? Yep. So yeah. these bangle bracelets are $5. We also have some new products. We're working with another group of women in northern Uganda mm -hmm. who are collecting shea nuts, and they're creating shea butter for soap, lip balm, and um, shea butter. Very nice, very nice. And ladies, don't worry. If you want to get something for your man for Christmas out of this collection, Cliff, show everybody what what oh, you're wearing. Well, I have a yeah. magnificent bracelet. And necklace, the necklace there, guys. Can you get this on camera? This is beautiful. Yeah. Isn't that nice? Mm -hmm. So you can get this for men and for women. There you go, Cliff. Right. And all of this beautiful stuff. And Cliff, I know that uh, there's an event coming up on Thursday. Leah, I'll leave that one to you. Tell me about the event on Thursday. Um, well, MJ is doing a week-long event yeah. at their store. And um, Thursday is the main event. And I'll let Cliff talk about how they got involved with Bead for yeah. Life. Well, and we why got we're involved. Again, my do uh, daughter-in-law, yeah. Jennifer, she was reading the trades, and she saw Bead for Life. Yeah. And she knew Darlene and I had a passion for Africa. Yeah, we your wife. We were taken yep. to Africa. And when you see how people and just the thrill they have in working, they want to work. Mm -hmm. You know. If, in our world, the diamond world, yeah. we just, the locals uh, are all employed, now they're not. Mm -hmm. We need to sell more diamonds, and the, but nobody's asking for anything except an opportunity to work. And yeah. these women that were breaking rocks, literally, Oof. Uh, yeah. for a living, for a dollar a day, now can make seven dollars a day. So uh, our passions are there. We wanted to tie in, and the local businesses have got behind us. Delgado Dance Studio will mm -hmm. be there Thursday night. Ricardo's has uh, pitched in for African cuisine, nice. Mexican restaurant. Yeah, that's going to come out African, African cuisine. That's African pretty cool. Wines, which yeah. is cool with me. Yeah. <laughs> you know us. If we can right. party, we'll, we'll party. Do it. <laughs> and when we can help somebody yeah, and realize that the world is a lot different from America, and while yeah. it may be hard for us it's not yeah we're in the greatest place in the world and we need to reach out we sure do because I cannot imagine living in a mud hut and breaking rocks just to feed my son so yeah. this is
is really big. Tell everybody about the event once again, Cliff. It's going to be at our Eastern Avenue store, okay. and we're going to start at 5 o'clock, mm -hmm. and we're going to party until it's over, <laughs> until the wine's gone. So, I see. Uh, be yeah. there. Yeah, and Cliff does a lot in the community, so thank you to you and your wife, Darlene. She's on the uh, committee with me at Opportunity Village, so they do a lot of charitable work here in the Las Vegas Valley. So thank okay. you, and Leah, thank you so much. We can buy the jewelry at, at uh, yes, Dickerson at Center Eastern well? okay. and Boca Park okay. all week long. Okay, make sure to get out there and buy this jewelry, folks. It helps families, lots and lots of families. All right, Jace, you can get some of this jewelry, too. I know you're not a big jewelry guy, but you can get some of it, too. <laughs> well, listen, I all I know is that when I'm driving down the road and I hear Cliff on the radio, I never hear anything about no parting. <laughs> <laughs> I just hear that soothing voice telling me to go get some jewelry. But uh, if you want to throw that in there, I'll come to that party. <laughs> Party down. You have to listen to party All down. Right, party down. All right, what do you get when you take a hot shot TV producer and throw her on a morning show with difficult diva like anchors? All right, what's this all about? I know what you're thinking, but you're wrong. It's Rachel McAdams' new movie, Morning Glory, and we've got a sneak peek. Yeah, it better be her, not us. 